In the late 19th century, King Menelik II, one of Ethiopia's greatest leaders, embarked on an epic mission to modernize his country and transform it into a regional powerhouse. His ambitious plan included the construction of a railway line that would connect the country's capital, Addis Ababa, to the port of Djibouti, a distance of over 750 kilometers. Against all odds, King Menelik's vision became a reality, and the railway line was completed in 1917, after over a decade of construction. This engineering marvel not only transformed Ethiopia's economy, but also helped the country become a beacon of hope and inspiration for other African nations struggling for independence and progress. Fast forward to the present day, and Ethiopia is once again on the cusp of a new era of transformation and development. With over $26 billion invested by the World Bank, Ethiopia is embarking on a series of mega-projects that are set to redefine the nation's future. From massive dams and highways to airports and industrial parks, these projects are pushing the boundaries of what is possible and putting Ethiopia on the map as a global player in development. Join us as we take you on a journey through 25 of the most impressive mega-projects currently underway in Ethiopia, and witness firsthand how they are shaping the future of this dynamic and rapidly changing nation. 25. Unity Park, $50 million. The Unity Park is a large beautification project in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, being built by the Prime Minister with a budget of 5 billion Ethiopian beer. It will cover 20 hectares and offer visitors the chance to learn about Ethiopian history and culture, view historical buildings and artifacts, and see exotic animals at the zoo. The park is not yet open to the public, but is expected to be opened soon. 24. Renovation of Addis Ababa City Hall – $54 million The Addis Ababa City Hall is undergoing a renovation project, which includes landscaping, office renovations, and the construction of new facilities, like an 850-seat theater hall. The project aims to improve functionality and aesthetics, making it a more welcoming space for employees and visitors. Though still under construction, the project is expected to be completed soon. Once finished, it will continue to house the offices of the municipality of Addis Ababa, Ethiopia. 23. Addis Ababa Convention Centers – $100 million Addis Ababa is experiencing a construction boom that includes several convention centers. The United Nations Conference Center and the Addis Ababa International Convention and Exhibition Center are two modern facilities that host events like conferences, exhibitions, and trade shows. The Addis Ababa City Hall is undergoing a renovation project that includes an 850-seat theater hall and a convention center to make it a hub for events and conferences in the city. The project is still under construction but is expected to be completed soon. 22. Adwa Center $156 million The Adwa Center is a construction project in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, to commemorate the Battle of Adwa. It will feature a museum, meeting hall, auditoriums, parking, cinema theater, library, gym, and child care center. Construction began in 2019 and is being carried out by a Chinese firm. Once completed, it will be a symbol of African victory over European colonialism and the strength and resilience of the Ethiopian people. 21. City Library $200 million Addis Ababa has several libraries, but the city administration plans to construct a larger one, the AA City Library, which will have a capacity of up to 3,500 people. It will feature theater halls, meeting spaces, and sections for both adult and children's library. The library is still under construction and is expected to open soon. In January 2022, the Abrohet Library and Arakilo was opened, offering stunning night views of the city's newest library. 20. National Palace Parking Lot $250 million The National Palace of Ethiopia is undergoing an extensive restoration project, causing Unity Park to be closed to the public.
The park was built by the Prime Minister with a budget of 5 billion Ethiopian bear, and offers visitors the chance to learn about Ethiopian history and culture, view historical buildings and artifacts, and see exotic animals at the zoo. While closed, the restoration work promises to bring new grandeur and beauty to the historic site. 19. Mescal Square Redevelopment $250 million Mescal Square, the iconic public gathering space in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, is currently undergoing a massive renovation project as part of the Beautifying Shiger Initiative. This ambitious project, which has a budget of $250 million, is set to give Mescal Square and Churchill Road City Hall a major facelift and increase the capacity of the square to host religious holidays, concerts, and other major events. The renovation work, which involves state-of-the-art technologies, is still ongoing and is expected to be completed in the near future. Once finished, the newly renovated Mescal Square will be a stunning showcase of modern design and engineering, and a testament to Ethiopia's commitment to urban development. 18. Addis Africa International Convention and Exhibition Center $270 million the Addis Africa International Convention and Exhibition Center is a public-private investment project in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, costing more than $270 million. It aims to establish an international convention and exhibition center for various events. The construction is making great progress, and it will have a significant impact on the meetings, incentives, conferencing, and exhibitions industry in Ethiopia. The project is still under construction and is expected to be completed soon. The shares of the center are available for purchase at various banks in Addis Ababa. 17. Beautifying Shiger $290 million The Beautifying Shiger Initiative is an ongoing project in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, aimed at improving public spaces, buildings, and infrastructure. It includes several projects, such as the renovation of Mescal Square and Churchill Road City Hall, the Addis Ababa City Municipality Renovation Project, the Adwa 00 Chem Museum Project, the Science Museum, and the Addis Africa International Convention and Exhibition Center. All are under construction but expected to be completed soon. The initiative is part of the Ethiopian government's efforts to enhance the country's positive image globally and transform lives. 16. The TAMS Project $300 million The TAMS Project is a multipurpose project in southwestern Ethiopia that is still under construction. It is expected to generate 5,760 GW of electricity with a capacity of 1,700 MW and an estimated cost of $300 million. The project is set to be a game-changer in the region's energy sector and is expected to be completed soon. Other ongoing projects in Addis Ababa include the Addis Ababa City Municipality Renovation Project and the Adwa 00 Chem Museum Project. 15. Well of Sefer $400 million Well of Sefer in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, is the site of several ongoing projects. The Bol Road Well of Sefer overpass, designed by Iskinder Halu, connects the Bol area to the city center and helps to ease traffic congestion. It is still under construction but expected to be completed soon. The inclusive naming of Sefer Initiative aims to promote inclusive naming practices in Addis Ababa. Another project is the new INSA headquarters, which will house various government offices and cost $400 million on 7,000 550 square meters of land. It is also still under construction. 14. The Mesub Tower $400 million The Mesub Tower is a 70-floor mixed-use building under development on 50,000 square meters of land in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia. It will be the tallest building in Ethiopia and cost $400 million. The construction is set to begin soon after a memorandum of understanding was signed, and its unique design reflects Ethiopia's culture and heritage. 
The project is expected to be a game changer in Ethiopia's growth and development, and its completion is eagerly anticipated. 13. Janael Dawa 3 $451 million Janael Dawa 3 is a 254-megawatt hydroelectric power project under construction in the southern nations, nationalities, and peoples region of Ethiopia. It comprises a concrete-faced rock-fill dam and an underground powerhouse with three vertical Francis turbine generators. Construction began in 2013, and the project is expected to have a lifetime of more than 1,000 years. It is funded by the Ethiopian government, the African Development Bank, and the World Bank, and once completed, it will be wholly owned and operated by the government of Ethiopia. 12. Aluda Langano Geothermal Project $620 million The Aluda Langano Geothermal Project is an ongoing construction of a geothermal power plant in Arsi, Oromia region, Ethiopia. The Aluda Langano I is the oldest geothermal power station in Ethiopia, established in 1998, with a capacity of 8.5 megawatts. The project is still under construction, and production testing on three wells has been completed with promising results. The state-owned Ethiopian Electric Power is developing the project, which faced delays due to a lack of water supply and remaining works. Drilling began in May 2021, and the project is expected to increase Ethiopia's renewable energy capacity and reduce its dependence on fossil fuels. 11. The Transport Systems Improvement Project $681 million The Transport Systems Improvement Project is a World Bank-funded project under construction in Ethiopia, aimed at transforming the transport system. It involves rehabilitating selected corridors, installing an infrastructure for driving licensing and vehicle registration, and acquiring communication systems for Addis Traffic Police. Once completed, it is expected to improve road safety and integrate Ethiopia's transport system with the rest of the African continent's trans-African free transport. A monitoring and evaluation consultancy service has also been established to ensure the project's success. 10. Renovation Prime Minister's Office and Grand Manelik Palace $700 million the renovation of the Prime Minister's office was carried out by Dubai-based ALEC Engineering and Contracting LLC, which was also involved in the restoration of the office of the Prime Minister. The renovation work of the municipality headquarters, located at the center of the city in Piazza area, started in August 2020 and involved landscaping, renovating offices, and building new facilities, such as a children's playground inside the premises of the municipality. The Grand Manelik Palace, which was the last residence of Emperor Hale Selassie, is part of the National Palace of Ethiopia and has never been opened to the general public. 9. Fairfax, $1.5 billion The Fairfax project in Ethiopia involves constructing an oil refinery in a washed town, led by Fairfax Africa Fund in collaboration with partners from Asian countries. The project is still under construction and has an estimated cost of 4 billion US dollars, with a capacity to process 120,000 barrels per day. Once completed, it will serve the East African market and primarily Ethiopia's energy security program, with the capacity to refine 12 million metric tons of crude oil yearly. The refinery will import crude through neighboring Djibouti, and significant work is ongoing to complete the ambitious project. 8. Laguerre, $1.9 billion Laguerre is a mixed-use real estate development project under construction in the center of Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, by Eagle Hills, a UAE-based company. It includes over 4,000 residences, retail and food outlets, hotels, offices, and green plazas, with a gross floor area of approximately 360,000 square meters. The project is ongoing, with various aspects still under construction, and aims to provide a unique lifestyle, hospitality, retail, commercial, and leisure offering within a single integrated community. 
The first residential tower, One Laguerre, was launched in 2020, and the project is eagerly anticipated. 7. The Addis Ababa Light Rail Transit, $2 billion. The project includes the rehabilitation of selected corridors, the improvement of traffic signals, and the construction of pedestrian crossings in Addis Ababa. The project also involves the installation of IT infrastructure and systems to automate driving licensing and vehicle registration, and the acquisition of communication systems for Addis Traffic Police to enhance traffic enforcement. The project aims to improve mobility along selected corridors in Addis Ababa and the effectiveness of road transport. The project is located in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia. 6. Addis Tomorrow, $3 billion. The Addis Tomorrow project is a special economic zone committed to building a model for Ethiopia's future urban development based on Ethiopia, radiating Africa, and serving the world, matching its position as the political center of Africa. The project aims to create a sustainable and innovative environment for businesses and investors, providing them with a range of services and facilities to support their growth. 5. Addis Ababa Adama Expressway, $3.2 billion. The Addis Ababa Adama Expressway is an ongoing toll road construction project that connects Addis Ababa to Adama, Ethiopia. The project, which is being constructed by the China Communications Construction Company, is the first expressway in Ethiopia and aims to reduce heavy traffic between its two endpoints. The road has six lanes on two sides for its 84.7 km length, and while significant work has been done, various aspects of the project are still under construction. Once completed, the road is expected to reduce the time required to reach Adama from Addis Ababa to 45 minutes, a reduction of more than 50% over the time on previously available routes. The Ethiopian government is covering 43% of the road's construction cost, while the remaining 57% is being covered by the Chinese government. While the road was officially opened to the public in September 2014, significant work is still ongoing to bring this ambitious project to completion. 4. The Addis Ababa Djibouti Railway, $4 billion. The Addis Ababa Djibouti Railway is an electrified single track standard gauge line construction project connecting Ethiopia's capital to the port of Djibouti with 45 stations. It was constructed between 2011 and 2016 and financed by the Ethiopian and Djiboutian governments, built by the China Railway Group and China Civil Engineering Construction Corporation. The railway line will provide landlocked Ethiopia with access to the sea, linking Addis Ababa with Djibouti and its port of Durale. While inaugurated in 2018, significant work is ongoing to complete the project. 3. The Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam, $4.8 billion. The Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam is a hydroelectric dam construction project on the Blue Nile River in Ethiopia, expected to cost close to 4.8 billion US dollars and more than double the country's electricity output. However, it has caused tension among Egypt, Sudan, and Ethiopia due to its potential impact on other users of Nile River water. The lack of international financing is attributed to Egypt's campaign to keep control of the Nile water share, and significant work is ongoing to complete the project. The project remains a topic of global interest, and tensions persist surrounding its impact on other Nile River water users. 2. The Bol Airport, Africa's largest airport, $5 billion. Bol International Airport is an ongoing expansion project located 8 kilometers southeast of Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, and is the larger of the two international airports located in Addis Ababa, the second being the Ladia Airport located in the southwest of the capital. The airport, also known as Hale Selassie I International Airport, serves as the main hub for Ethiopian Airlines, the national airline of Ethiopia. While significant work has been done to expand the airport, the project is still ongoing, 
and the most recent expansion plan was announced in 1999. The airport is equipped with modern facilities and serves both domestic and international flights, with its IATA code being added and its ICAO code being HAAB. 1. LAPSAT $24 billion the Lamu Port South Sudan Ethiopia Transport or LAPSET Corridor Project is an ongoing infrastructure project aimed at interconnecting Kenya, Ethiopia, and South Sudan. It includes the construction of a new port in Lamu, an oil pipeline, refinery, airport, railway lines, and highway system to promote regional trade and economic integration. While under construction, it has faced opposition from communities concerned about their heritage. The project is spearheaded by the Kenyan government and currently funded by domestic tax revenue. Once completed, it is expected to increase Djibouti port capacity by Ethiopia, facilitating 80% of its international trade. And that concludes our look at 25 impressive mega-projects currently ongoing in Ethiopia in 2023. From transportation infrastructure to energy and real estate development, these projects are poised to transform Ethiopia's economy and improve the lives of its citizens. While significant progress has been made on many of these projects, they are all still under construction, with various aspects of the projects still ongoing. As the projects continue to progress towards completion, we can expect to see even more exciting developments and achievements in Ethiopia's future. The completion of these mega-projects is a testament to Ethiopia's commitment to progress and development, and we look forward to seeing the positive impact they will have on the country and the region as a whole. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed it, then make sure to leave a like, and also subscribe if you haven't, and we'll see you in the next one.